that I learned as a blue belt from a really big guy. His name is Seth Woodall. He was actually one of the first Americans to win a, uh, a world title in Brazil. He did it at the blue belt level. Um, and he's uh, he was a wrestler, and uh, I met him through Paragon. And he's a big, giant guy. He's like 280 pounds. Uh, so, you know, I never really uh, took any of his moves seriously because they were big guy moves and I was a little guy. Uh, but there was one move that I got from him that I repeated, I, I use almost every time I roll. And I actually was able to uh, able to use it uh, my first match against Kyotera, where I was able to beat him. It was the match, it was the, the final move where I was able to get onto his back. And uh, I'll demonstrate it for you guys here, okay? So here's the idea is, uh, the way it happens, come on here please, is when you're sitting guard like this and, and they double up on your pants, right? Right, whenever they do this, which was pretty common, happens all the time, happens almost every time I roll in fact, okay? The idea was what Seth was telling me was to grip upside down pistol grip like this, okay? And what's gonna happen is they're gonna push down on your legs, they're gonna stand up, put all their weight down into this, and they're gonna walk across. Let's see if you walk across this side to pass my guard, okay, just like this. And the idea is when he does this is I let go of this one, but I, I, I extend this one more. This one goes back, and I'm gonna hold the dude here, okay? And now here's the idea, is that I let go, and, and, and also too, the reason I'm holding his sleeve on this right side is so he can't let go. If I let go of it, he can come up and hug my head. So if I let go of that sleeve, he heads, gets head control, pass my guard. Okay, so not good. So do that again. So they get that inside grip, right? You double up on them. He goes to that side. I push this one and, and reach my hand back. Okay, and you may have to fight here for a little bit. Okay, just kind of keep them from going too far over. Right, they, they might try to switch back around to the other side where you'll have to switch, so like go, go to the other side, Andy. You'll have to switch there too. Okay, go back around again. Every time he does that, I switch that. Okay, and pretty much what happened was, um, did you see the arm drag right there? Okay, How, put your knees down. We got into this position, and I was able to let go of this right hand on his sleeve and reach up here for this drag. Okay, and what I did was I, I did a big butt scoot, I dragged this arm by, and it brought me to here. Okay, and then from here I was able to load them up and take them back. Okay. Okay, so whenever they double up on your pants, so you're here, they double up on your pants as I sit up and get that double pistol grip, thumbs down. Okay, just step around to the side, extend this one, reach this one back. Okay, perfect. Now I let go of the sleeve here, come up for the arm drag, pop my hips out come up onto the guy's back. Oh, okay. And that's pretty much, that's how I was able to get caught. Another thing that's cool about this suite too, this is the, uh, there's like a, a roll option, okay? What'll happen is, same setup, okay? He passes around to the side. What I can do is from here, is uh, move back a little bit, move back a little bit. Okay, pass around a little more to your left. If he stays here and I can't get that arm drag, is I can pop up onto my knee and sweep them that way. Now here's the cool part about this too. You roll, position yourself, right, into a triangle. Boom. Right, or an omnicata. Right? It's really cool. It's one of my favorite moves. I I use this almost every time I roll. Okay? Very common reaction. Guys grab the inside of those pants. Sit up. They pass around. Right? If I can't get that arm drag, maybe he let go of that or something, is I'll keep this here, pop my hips up underneath him, and roll him towards the camera here. Boom. Okay, if I continue rolling here, you catch that triangle, probably go to the plot. Okay? So the, that's one of my favorite combos, okay? Is that double attack I have when they pass around. If I can get, one, I'm defending the guard pass, you know what I'm saying? Two, if I can get this arm drag, and three, if I can pop underneath him and roll him that way. Boom. All right, if you'll see, I, I actually, uh, I was able to get that on, on Kyle Terra at the, uh, I think it was the last minute of our first match, the World Expo. I was able to get on his back and score some points and win the match with that, so it's a really good move. Works, works a lot of the times.